everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. I want to thank, I have four people I want to thank because they're actually going to keep me accountable for this trying to not put sugar in my coffee and following me on my weight or the challenge that I'm giving myself to try to lose the 20 pounds that I have gathered. And the people are, I wrote your names down so I'm going to have to look. Uh, Sylvia Huddle, thank you very much. She's one of them. Marsha, Mush and Stuff. Marsha's going to help me too. This is great. I love it because I have to, I will put in my comment how I'm doing if I'm not doing good. Or you can ask me and I will tell you, I'm sure. Gary Cecil and Vicki Marie Living Life. Thank you very much, all four of you. This is great because, you know, sometimes you need somebody to have to be accountable to. I tell Jim, but he says, eh, if you want it, go ahead. <laughs> he's He doesn't restrict anything from me. He lets me have whatever I wish. And I'm going to put a little video in right here. work and what does he do? Find something to do. He might clean the driveway with his tractor instead of his plow. It just changes things up a little, I guess. But yeah, he cleaned the driveway. He's got that half yet to do. And he sees me now. I'm going back in though, because it's a little chilly. Just a little chilly. I was sitting at the computer listening to somebody's video. I don't remember whose video I was listening to. And I hear this motor outside and I'm thinking, hmm, that sounds like the tractor. I wonder if Jim's home. Yep, he was home. He has got home from work and hops on the tractor and starts cleaning the driveway. Now really, is there? it's cold outside. He doesn't realize how cold it is. And I had it's to... It's not cold. Oh, it was cold. And um, I had... It was cold enough to where, because the chicken water, actually, we have never had this happen, but the the chimney block where the light is, I don't know if it's because it's up higher. In the, I think it's up higher this year, and that's and why And the container froze. was getting empty. It froze. It's been really cold. So he put a higher voltage light bulb wattage. in there. What is wattage? Oh. Wattage. <laughs> <laughs> Not a voltage. Huh. I don't know. Wattage, a higher wattage, I don't know, electricity. Can you yeah. tell? I don't know electricity. <laughs> but he put a different bulb in it. did have, I think, a 60 watt. Yep. Had a 16, we put a 100, 100. watt in. So now that should not freeze. Should well, not freeze at all. when it starts to all. warm up, we're going to have to switch it back. Well, yeah, when it warms up, we can actually turn it off to um, so they don't have warm water to drink. But... You should have seen the chickens. They don't, don't normally come out the door. I opened the door for them because it was sunny outside. And they all came outside and they were all eating snow. Their water had gone. So they were really thirsty. So it's a good thing I, w I check on them every single day. And I always check the water to see where it is. And with the ice in there, it looked like they had a lot. So I went over and looked and I thought, what's going on? But it was dry because the, the water had froze. So now they've got the two small containers because I brought them out. And I know they will freeze, but mm. they will drink from them until they are froze. And they've got the big one now. And tomorrow, let's hope there's more sunshine because I'll open the door and let them out. They, they really like to come out and be in the dirt. They won't go in the snow unless they get scared. That one jump, jumped in the snow, but it was one of the younger ones. That's because Jim was with me. They kind of shy away. <laughs> okay, I I get, I'm feeling. I'm feeling they're helping with water. <clears throat> I know, and he's bringing them water. They should like the fact that he's bringing them water. Well, my voice feels a little hoarse for some reason. I hadn't been talking much, apparently. Apparently. And um, so I'm going to say goodbye, and I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. I did good today. I haven't done my jump roping yet, but I shall do that and get it done. So. I will see you all. And drinking the water. Yes, I've drank some water, but I should drink more of that also. So I guess I've got 
mentioned everything I'm supposed to be doing. Hope you're doing it too. Alrighty, bye-bye.